In this lesson, we will look at creating new project files from templates. When you start project, you will see Microsoft's feature templates on the right side of the screen. Or you can even search for some industry-specific templates on the search box at the top. If you find something resembling what you want, you can load that template with a click. I am going to show you an example now. I want to create a project file for a software project based on Agile. So here I search for Agile. And I have one result returned. A preview is also shown with some info on the template itself. I can also set the project start date conveniently here. In a previous lesson, we had seen that this is one of the first things we have to set. And when I click on create, the template is downloaded and a project is created. Now let us step back for a moment and understand what exactly this is about. So what exactly are templates? A template is a project that has been specifically designated to be used more than once by you or somebody else. A template has special characteristics, one being that it is saved into a special location reserved for template. Templates are specifically useful for establishing consistent and repeated activities in a project so you do not have to start a project from scratch every time. For example, if you were in construction, you might be building condominiums and each condo project requires similar activities. You could set up a project once with all the tasks already entered and save it as a template to be used over and over for each condo project. As another example, suppose you are working on a major acquisition project. You can easily make a template that has custom fields that can be used by both the buyer and the seller. Project templates do not have to be very detailed or include all project information. Instead, project templates need to contain the common and repeatable project details that you can easily modify to fit to the new project that you are creating. A template can help you set standards for projects within your organization, especially if the project structure and setup can be reused by several other project managers. A template enables you to reuse common tasks, project information, customized fields, calendars, and notes in a template project. It also lets you set up shared standard resources and equipment lists. Most organizations repeatedly deliver similar projects. Templates can be very useful for capturing the best practices developed into repeatable standards and reporting, giving new projects a great jump start to success. The top two levels of a WBS can very often be used consistently across an organization. The project management elements can be standardized, as can many other cross-cutting elements. Standard templates will minimize the amount of startup work required to determine process use for each project and will also improve the organization's ability to control scope on the elements that are consistently used across projects. But please note, if you choose to create your project schedule from an existing template, you will have to modify the data that is stored in the template to tailor it exactly to your specific project. To do so, use the same methods described in the upcoming lessons. You can also designate a location to store your templates conveniently on your computer. To do this, let us again go to the options. First, click the File tab, then Options. The Project Options dialog box opens up. Here, look for the Save tab. In the Save Templates section, you will find the default personal templates location. In this box, I will browse a new location on my computer like so.
and click OK. What this does is, if I now go back to the new tab in Backstage, I can see a new heading has been created for my personal templates. And this location will hold the templates I have stored. This is just another convenient method to access your templates. So, in this lesson, we saw the power of templates and when it will be a good idea to use them. As you get more familiar with projects, you can start creating your own library of templates for future usage. 